Tuesday Tips on Thursday. I wanted to get this one out to you because it's pretty important. Mark here for notapayingdown.com. I want to talk today about marijuana grow operations, grow ups, or as they're often referred to in BC, mortgage helpers. So today I'm holding in my hand what what's probably considered your only protection against buying a previous grow up and that's called a property disclosure statement. So let me tell you what this is. This is really an honor system piece of paper where the seller of the home has to answer some questions, yes or no, and one of those questions is, are you aware the premises or property have been used as a marijuana grow operation or to manufacture illegal drugs? And they have to click tick yes or no. Now, don't get me wrong, you're buying this home possibly from a guy who's used it as a, as a grow up and you're relying on the honor system that he's going to fill this out properly. So I'm not saying he isn't, but I want to tell you today one of the things you can do to protect yourself other than relying on this. Don't get me wrong, this is a legal document and if you do buy a previous grow up and you find out that this was not filled in correctly, sure you have a recourse. You can sue, you can hire a lawyer, it's going to take time, it's going to cost you money. Do you really want to do that? Because one of the things you have to realize is when a home gets busted as a grow up, it follows the house forever. So it doesn't matter whether I had the grow up and I sold it to Fred, Fred sold it to Ted and Ted sold it to Mary. When Mary goes to sell that home, she too has to fill out this property disclosure statement and disclose that it was a previous grow up. So sometimes that doesn't happen. So what can you do? Well, first of all, I hope that you're hiring a good property home inspector but even the best home inspectors may not detect it because I tell you this, I've seen some grow ups that have been fully renovated and put back on the market and even the best property inspectors can't tell. So what can you do? Really simple, a quick call down to City Hall and inquire about the address because as soon as a home gets busted as a grow up, the first thing that happens is City Hall gets contacted and that home gets tagged. So all you have to do, make a quick call down to City Hall, give them the address, tell you're thinking of buying, find out if it was used as any type of marijuana grow up or drug lab, lab or anything like that. So for quick questions, down to City Hall for grow up. Any other questions, to me, 604-273-2002 on the web, www.notapennydown.com. As usual, make it a great day, and we'll talk to you soon.